I'm very excited. Today I'm going to unbox this uh, Denon PMA SX11 integrated amplifier. So basically, you know, my cousin went to the store and then find out if they are willing to ship it because this is too heavy for her to handle it. So she went to the store and she found the store that willing to ship, but the problem is I don't get much discounts and we have to pay for the shipping plus um, tax, sales tax. But you know, I think it's well worth it. So let's get it started. I'm gonna uh, unbox it and set it up. So I just this is yeah. I want I want to know what is the production date on this one. I hope I got the uh, latest one. Wow. Oh. This is a remote control and then a battery. So, and then this is the uh, Japanese uh, owner's manual. So I'm gonna put these back in for now. Styrofoam tray. Very good quality uh, power code. It's very similar to the one that I get with the uh, Luxman, uh, Luxman 505 UX2. So it's very similar. This one is even look nicer. Oh, it looks great. I was worried this one is like, um, overall weight is like, uh, I think 32 kg. So 32 kg, uh, I have to ship with the uh, uh, Express. I want this because I have my many reasons. So. Alright, let's take it out. Let's open it. Whoa. Let me check the production date. Production date is 2019. There you go. That's the back of the unit. I will do the close-up shots later. My favorite thing is uh, I can put uh, moving quiet and moving magnet at the same time. <sighs> That's heavy. I'm gonna put the power power cable and then uh, turn it on. Let's turn it on. Make a click noise from the relay. That little orange or red light is blinking. Oh, that thing came on. The orange light, orange illumination around. Now it's ready. This is nice, very nice. I, I like this kind of simple design. So that's the uh, input selector and then a volume control knob, balance control knob, and headphone input. That's it. No tone control, nothing. Everything is made of metal. And this is the one beautiful unit. The made in Japan uh, craftsmanship is, I'm a big fan of uh, their craftsmanship from woodwork to uh, electronic hi-fi components. So there's my old Denon PME 2004R. Not top of the line Denon, this is the, uh, the one below. So top of the line Denon is currently PME SX1 limited edition. And this one is just below that. Okay, let's get it connected and let's get it rolling. I still love you. I'm gonna use it in a different room. Let's get this guy out, my old buddy. Oh, man. So this is the transformer that I'm using and I'm using Power Bright. 3000G uh, step down transformer. It runs super quiet. Yep, 91 degree. So it's run pretty cool and no noise, no humming noise, no vibration. It's dead silent. And this one weights like uh, 37 pounds. The transformer itself. So that's what I'm using. 
I will have the link in the video description for the people who might need a step down transformer from 120 to 100 volt. This one is made in China but very good quality transformer. Super quiet, no heat, no sound, nothing. It's just super silent. Highly recommended. So that's the transformer that I'm going to use from now on until uh, I figure how to rewire the uh, transformer inside the amplifier. I just finished reading the uh, Japanese uh, manual for this uh, Denon PMA SX11. So on this remote control that come with this unit, only uh, six buttons gonna work with this amplifier. If I hit the uh, power button for five seconds, amplifier will turn on uh, automatic standby mode. If I hit the power button five seconds again, standby modes will be turned off. Right now, halo ring light is at the bright position. So if I want to go to dim, just push the button for five seconds of the mute button. It will go to dim and if I push the button again, it's gonna go to off position without any light around the uh, volume control knob. It has the uh, three brightness control through that mute button on the uh, remote control. It's a bright, dim, and off position of the light. Then if I hit the mute button again for five seconds, it will come back to full brightness as it came from the factory. So those are the features that I can use on this remote control. Volume up and down, input selection, mute button, and the uh, light dimming function at the same feature. This dimmer button is only for CD or SACD player that Denon made. Then a power button also function as the uh, standby on off feature of the amplifier. So volume control knob, every time I hit the volume up and down button on the remote control, it goes like a quarter inch decreasement or increasement. This volume control knob is an analog volume control knob. That's the uh, another reason I choose this one. Wow, super quiet. I put it all the way to 12 o'clock. There is no noise, no hissing noise, no white noise, nothing there. It's just super quiet. Let's try to take it up to 2 o'clock. Now I can hear a little bit. This is crazy good. Let's try an input uh, selector. Now I'm at the uh, CD. So if I change the input selectors, this little light, the green light will turn to red and it will blink until it's ready and it turns back to green again here. It's blinking. It's clicked and now it's green and it's ready. So let's play again. I only need to go up to like an 8 o'clock position to get the uh, my reference level loudness and the power wise very impressive so that's it. This is just quick unboxing and an uh, initial impression of a Denon PMA SX11 integrated amplifier. But only downside is this, is this unit is very heavy. That's it my friends. Thank you for watching and happy listening.
Oh, oh, oh. 